So we've been working with UN UIDA on three levels. Firstly, on development work in general across Sub-Saharan Africa. And uh, we've also been working with UN UIDA on um, capacity building. And thirdly, uh, on uh, research uh, for development, uh, particularly in climate change and its impact on African economies. When we started out with the capacity building work, the idea was basically to go into research. But we quickly realized that um, there is very little capacity across sub-Saharan African countries uh, on uh, climate change and its impact, and therefore uh, issues of mitigation and adaptation were scarcely known across uh, sub-Saharan Africa, particularly uh, north uh, of uh, uh, the Zambezi River. So uh, we realized that we had to uh, do some capacity building before we actually go into research. Uh, so we conducted um, a distance learning course that enabled us to uh, meet uh, some level of expertise before we went into research. We did um, uh, work in Ghana uh, on fisheries. Uh, and, and how they are being affected by the changes in the climate and how that can translate to um, policy, uh, particularly adaptation and mitigation. We did work in uh, Uganda, in, in Tanzania, Ethiopia, um, particularly uh, as um, the changes in climate uh, affect uh, households. Uh, we also did work in Mozambique and in uh, Cameroon. Uh, these were all small grants awarded to researchers and uh, uh, graduate students that had an interest in understanding and therefore communicating the, re the results of their work to policymakers. The ARC has two big programs, um, the research arm um, and the capacity training building arm. When we realized that there was uh, capacity on, on climate change research across of the network, we um, built uh, a program, not only in research, but also in actual graduate training. Uh, with the assistance of uh, UNU wider we put up a course on climate, the economics of climate change at both master's level and a PhD level. Uh, and it is with the support of, of WIDA that we were able to put together a curriculum for both uh, masters in economics, uh, masters in uh, 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 agricultural economics, and then we developed it further into a course in the uh, PhD level. ARC has enormous reach across Sub-Saharan Africa. I would say it, it is the single largest uh, economics network in, in Sub-Saharan Africa. And what the work that we do gets translated into, um, into policy. So we reach policymakers at a very high level. Uh, but our alumni also do work at the lower levels. So with UN UIDA, we are able to translate um, their global reach to an African level at various levels. So we complement each other in that way. Uh, 